Former Vice President Atiku Abubakar has assured Nigerians that he is committed to restoring the nation to a great height it uh, once attained. He made this call at a ceremony where he was issued a certificate of return as the presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party in Abuja. Miriam Mohammed reports. Since losing the 2015 presidential elections, the People's Democratic Party has been in opposition constantly heckling ruling party all progressive Congress. The PDP believes it's the only political party that can wrestle power from the APC in the forthcoming 2023 general elections. And now it believes it has the linchpin in place to achieve this dream. Former Vice President Atiku Abubakar. All PDP chieftains have come together to support former Vice President, expressing confidence that his victory at the primaries is the first step in a sure process of attaining power at the center. At the ceremony, Atiku receives his certificate of return and commends the party's National Working Committee. He urged members of the party to work together to win the 2023 presidency. He also disclosed his commitment to rebuilding the nation's economy and restoring security. What just happened is a contest within a family to decide how to put our best foot forward. The main contest is the one to win the presidency of our country for our party. And it requires the entire PDP family and other supporters and sympathizers. We must pull everyone together. Nobody should be excluded, I beg of you. While Atiku is celebrating victory, some concerned members of the party were not happy that the National Working Committee failed to abide by the party's constitution. Section 7, subsection 3C and sections 46, subsection 3 of the PDP 2017 constitution as amended deals with imperatives of zoning the presidency, party policy and constitution. The group is calling for the resignation of the national chairman and national secretary. The party constitution in section 7, subsection 3 has stated it clearly. The North cannot have the president's uh, flag bearer and also have the national chairman. And the national chairman is from the same zone with the beauty chairman. The group lays down 20th June 2022 as the deadline for this party executive to resign. Failing which a series of protests organized at the PDP national secretariat to force their removal. Maria Mohamed, TVC News, Abuja.